time to dish in the Win Dixie kitchen. And we're gonna do a really cool spin on a traditional meal for breakfast, and that's the Pop Tart. We're gonna learn how to make them at home. And the inspiration, where it came from, Edible Northeast Florida Magazine, where they actually did a feature on how to make these at home. And we have two people with us today. My two guests are Samantha, the owner of Vagabond Coffee, and then also to Robin, who's a baker there, who's gonna go step by step on how to make Pop Tarts for home. So welcome, tell me a little bit about the shop first. Yeah, so we started out in Hemming Park um, downtown, and we have a little caravan out there, and um, we started making Pop-Tarts because we thought it'd be a fun, interesting uh, baked good, and then now we have our shop in Murray Hill. Oh, wow. And um, everyone loves the Pop-Tarts, and they order them, they cater out, and it's been great. It's been a really fun thing to do. And it really is. It's just a favorite of everybody. Yeah. It's, it's a comfort food. We all yeah. grew up with them, mm -hmm. but these look a lot fancier. These are so, a lot better. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. yeah so, yeah. Robin, you're going to take us through kind of step-by-step step on how we would make these at home, correct? Yeah. So, first, you just want to prepare your pie dough, um, and then we roll it out by four and a half by seven rectangles. Um, so we just, you know, work the dough yeah. and the flour. And again, so this is just pie dough to start out, right? Yeah. So anybody could buy pie dough. Buy it or make it yourself, whatever is easier for you if you're busy and you know there's nothing wrong with the store-bought dough. Okay, and um, then once you flatten it out then, yeah, so the next step yeah, would be cutting it into the is like this. Yep, and then I have prepared here our blueberry filling. And then you just wanna like put a little what tablespoon two tablespoons into the middle and what's exactly in this jar so it looks like we have blueberries, blueberries sugar and there's sugar. some kind of marinade or something um, in there some kind it's of liquid? just i've just let them sit with vanilla and lemon juice and then we just sprinkle a little bit of lavender on top and then fold them in half and then you can just take a fork to crease the edges well, there we go. So that kind of seals one. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then let's go back to the contents like in the jar then. So you already went through the ingredients. How long do you let it sit? Um, when I make them at the shop or even if you make them at home, you could, don't need to let it sit for any time. It's just going to, you know, get all mixed together inside the pop tart and in the oven. So just put your ingredients together and then it's good to go. Perfect. So basically right now we have the... Uh, the base of the yeah. Pop-Tart. Mm -hmm. So the next step would be to bake um, it, right? Yep, so just put it on your sheet pan, make sure you sprayed it. And then I like to just put some egg wash over the top of it. And then it's ready for the oven. That um, looks good uncooked, so I know it's gonna be delicious <laughs> once it is cooked. Yep. And then the final product would look something like, like this, this. Yep. Right? And then um, I like to just put a little bit of glaze on top of them. I like to put a lot of glaze on them. Yeah, <laughs> a little, a lot, whatever you wanna do. Um, and we then, can put some extra glaze on it. Yeah, oh, good, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can we do that? Can we do it a la carte if we go? Oh, yeah. Of course, yes. of course. And then just, you know, so it looks pretty. And uh, what, what are these, these little These sprinkles are just um, lavender buds. Oh, that looks really yep. good. So that's inside the pop jar and then you just sprinkle on top. All right. Yeah. Well, definitely you guys have to go check out um, Edible right here, the magazine. There's an article in here that has the recipe. So it's Edible Northeast Florida Magazine. You could also go to RiverCityLiveTV.com to download the recipe. You could get this anywhere you get your reads, any newsstand. And then also too, you gotta come and check out Vagabond yeah. Coffee. Yeah, come and see us. All right, this locations. looks absolutely amazing. Yeah, Thanks again, you. Samantha and Robin. Can no I have a bite of this right now? Absolutely. All right, we'll be back right after this.